A backup put in place to protect your system could actually be opening you up to more risks. Steve Ranger is here uh, for more on a new warning coming out from experts, uh, cybersecurity experts on this. Steve, what are they saying? What are people doing wrong here? Sure. So what's gone wrong here is uh, this, this is a warning from the uh, National Cybersecurity Center, which is uh, the, the UK's uh, cybersecurity center. And it's warning about uh, how companies are getting it wrong when they're trying to protect themselves from ransomware. Now, uh, what, a really good way of protecting yourself against ransomware, which is this file encrypting software that just encrypts all of your, all of your stuff and you end up having to pay a big ransom to these uh, cyber crooks, is to have a good backup. So even if your systems do get encrypted, uh, you can just say, well, I'm not paying the bill, I'm not paying your ransom because I can just uh, bring everything back from the backups and uh, I'm fine. Um, that's okay as long as you don't leave the backups connected to your main system. And that's what the uh, NCSC is warning about. They've seen quite a few cases where uh, companies have done the right thing by creating a backup and then done absolutely the wrong thing by leaving it online so that when they do get hit by ransomware, uh, everything's encrypted and they're back at square one. So basically what they're saying is, don't do it that way. Make sure that if you are making a backup, which is a very good idea, you make sure that it's offline. It's not connected to your other systems so that if you do get hit by anything like this, and it, 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 there could be other things that could happen as well. It could be you know, some sort of disaster recovery thing, might be your office floods or whatever, but uh, ransomware is one of the key problems here, is that if one of these uh, disasters does hit you, you have got an offline backup, which you can restore all your systems from and save yourself a whole bunch of hassle and, and having to potentially pay a ransom, which you don't want to do anyway because you don't want to uh, be giving these crooks more money. Yeah, most certainly. All right, Steve. Well, besides, uh, you know, making sure you're offline, what else uh, is being suggested? I mean, we talk about ransomware a lot in, in attacks like this. Just what are some of the common things that uh, folks need to keep in mind? Sure. So um, absolutely. Lots of common things you need to keep in mind. Lots of it is basic security hygiene. So uh, make sure you're not using default passwords. Make sure that systems aren't connected to the, to the internet that don't need to be connected to the internet. Uh, make sure that uh, your uh, employees know uh, about phishing emails, because that's one way of, of, of ransomware getting into your system. Basically making sure that your updates are done. If you've got patch, if your systems need patches, uh, apply the patches. It's a, it's a pain and it's a hassle, but it's worth doing. Um, all of those things, these are the basic things you, you should be doing about any malware. So obviously this is gonna protect you from ransomware, but it will, it will protect you from many other types of uh, malware as well. Patch your systems, uh, educate your, your uh, staff uh, not to click on random things, uh, change those passwords, and if you and, and have those backups as well. That backups is a really important thing. Um, NCSC says there's a rule which is three, two, one. So have three copies on two devices and have one offline. So uh, all of those things together won't necessarily mean you won't get hit by ransomware but, or, or any other malware, but if you have all those things in place, uh, it should mitigate some of the impacts. Yeah, and Steve, uh, in closing here, you know, obviously on ZDNet and, and Tech Republic, we talk a lot about cybersecurity and things that companies need to keep in mind. Do you, from your perspective, do you feel like it seems like, uh, you know, the conversation in general is actually starting to work, that, that people are heeding these warnings? Because we're still hearing a lot of warnings about the same things. Yeah, I'm afraid so. I, I don't think that we're really learning all the lessons here. Um, you see uh, week in, week out stories about various organizations big and small getting hit by ransomware or being hit by malware. Um, the, the truth is that uh, any organization can, can get unlucky. Um, um, however, the, the, uh, the possibly the bigger truth is that lots and lots of organizations leave themselves open uh, and to, to unnecessary risk by not doing the things we talked about already, which are the sorts of basic things you would expect uh, you know, organizations large and small to do, but sadly not all do. Yep. All right. Lots to keep in mind, Steve. Thanks so much. For more on that security warning, uh, make sure you check out Steve's full article on ZDNet.